Oh yeah, super speed, super speed. Master Builder Chicken Bone. How about that? Hey, 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 what's up you guys? Chicken Bone here playing Ark Survival Evolved. And today I have some very bad news for you guys. This wall right here, um, I was making a video about how to do it, uh, you know, like double-sided and on foundations and in a straight line. And then my computer crashed. And then it turned out my, turns out my hard disk died. Uh, at least the one that has all the recordings on it. And it really died. So it's at the shop now and uh, it's costing heaps of money to actually get all the files from it. So, um... Yeah, I lost a few episodes there, but you know, today I can still show you because the wall uh, is not finished yet. Only problem is, let's see here, uh, we have this little uh, little bit to go here, and this is actually the easiest part. I wasn't gonna actually, you know, record this because this is just a straight line. Uh, luckily, uh, there's a problem here. Luckily, because that means I can still show you guys. Uh, as you can see, the foundation is obstructed. Now basically this is what you're gonna get uh, when you try and build a wall like this up a hill or something like I did over there and um, you're gonna get this problem a lot that is obstructed or you know is halfway in, in the ground or something and uh, I have a little fix for that and I, I showed you guys on that recording but that recording is just gone so uh, as you can see it's in a straight line this wall even though the foundations are raised up it's still in a straight line and I kind of want to show you how to do that so let's see here um, what you want to do if this happens that it says it's being obstructed what you want to do is you want to um, start off your build before you start making the wall you start off your build by placing uh, these wall found or fence foundations and you place them like half uh, half a foundation wide away from the place where you want your wall to be so as you can see I started down here uh, I was standing down here like so and I was like okay I want my wall to start right here at that edge right because you can't you can't climb up this and what I did is I just placed the foundation like you know eyeballing it half uh, half um, foundation wide and uh, then it places the foundation right there where, where it's where it's at now so that's basically what you want to do first and you want to just go along like this and then uh, you go all the way around and you go to the end where you want your wall to be and your wall is gonna follow that line so make sure you do the fence foundations uh, you can delete them later though <laughs> I don't really need these ones anymore that are right there but I just kept them because you know it crashed so um, what you wanna do if it's saying it's obstructed what you're gonna do is you're gonna skip one foundation don't place it here place it on the next foundation and then you want to go, let's see, like that. You go one more up, you get some thatch ceilings, like this. You place them like that, and then you go down again. But this isn't, where is it? Oh, wait, I'm using the wrong one. You go all the way down to the ground again. Now, this isn't going to fix it. Look, it, oh, there, well, it did. It just fixed it. I'm at at this point really lucky that it actually snapped to that pillar but most of the times it won't happen okay so I'm gonna show you what you do when it does let's see can I get it to go wrong <laughs> well I'm actually having trouble yeah most of the time it's gonna do this anyways even though you have this um, this pillar right here so what you can do is you can place another pillar right here snap it to that and place it there now you can delete all this stuff let's see if we can get it collapse there we go now this pillar is on a different level than um, than where it originally started at right here because these fence foundations uh, they do actually raise themselves up if, if there's like an incline uh, you can see that right here as you can see this foundation ends here but that other one starts higher so basically you're placing these pillars higher higher than uh, than the foundation is next to it that's basically the whole idea behind it right now as you can see this is going to be a pretty easy job I think this is going to be the only one we're raising today but that third pillar is there 
and now we can place a foundation here that it's never ever gonna say you can't if if it does say that you did something wrong because these pillars they actually snap on three uh, different points they snap at the right edge and the left edge of the fence foundation but also in the middle so it, you kind of have to take a close look at where the foundation starts which is right here so this is the left corner and then we go right and that's that's the middle so you have to make sure it's a middle okay so what you do is you just place this guy then and then the um, the part between these two the open part is exactly one foundation wide like that and it's gonna you know you're gonna be able to snap it to to the new foundation and that way you can place it and as you can see exactly straight and that's that's the trick I wanted to show you guys and then I, I recorded this whole episode where I built this wall and it was a pain in my butt because I think uh, like back there where the foundations come off the ground that was one of the most steep parts I've ever built on and I think you know it's it's not really beautiful but there's definitely not anyone that's gonna come through there uh, through there because we have like we have 10,000 HP walls and then we have these 10,000 HP ceilings and then we have another row of 10,000 HP walls so you know good luck getting in that's that's basically the whole idea behind behind a foundation wall right and you can you can walk on it you can walk on top of it but we're gonna do that later so um, I'm just gonna see if we can go ahead. I think we can just. This is not gonna be any problem. Well, it's getting a little bit higher. It seems. Uh, we ran out of foundations. But yeah. Um, so I lost all my stuff, guys, and it really sucks. Like I've. I've never, <laughs> ever had that happen to me before, and um, I know what you're gonna say. You have to back up your files on another disc but um, when I started YouTube I didn't have any you know I'm, I'm a student so I don't really have money to buy loads and loads of hard disks you know so um, yeah I, that just got you know I had to buy a, a really expensive microphone I had to buy some recording stuff and uh, you know new equipment for my computer so that it would run arc at a normal rate and um, yeah, basically that's that's where the money went. So uh, <laughs> I'm gonna have to save up for a new hard disk, and I'm just gonna have to do without like four terabytes of space. And uh, well, as you can see, we made it all the way over there. I think this is pretty close. I think that will be fine. We can probably do something with a ramp or something so that it actually comes together. But uh, at this point, when you have these foundations like this, you can just delete all the fence foundations. There's no problem. It's not gonna destroy anything. Uh, let's see here. Let's see, there's, there's, this is not gonna happen. It's just there, okay? So, um, for the wall itself, well, that's it's pretty obvious. I'm gonna I'm gonna do it with you guys, anyways, because this is uh, this is gonna be a, a pretty short episode. Uh, because I have a new game. I bought a new game, and I wanna I wanna start recording that stuff for you guys too. So I'm gonna have to, you know, I'm kind of gonna have to spend the day figuring out how the game works and you know record some stuff and I think it's gonna be a lot of fun so we're just gonna close off this whole part here and um, no we're gonna do the second row first oh yeah super speed super speed master builder chicken bone how about that that was real quick. I was kind of, I was kind of hoping that I wouldn't make a mistake. I'll be honest about that. <laughs> I was really scared I would make a mistake. Oh, hold on. Uh, no, I'm gonna place the door right here so we can actually get in the wall if we want to. And we're gonna just go like this. No mistakes. Oh yeah, we did that. We just did that again. Okay, third time. No, we made a mistake. Oh, that's just a shame. Okay, so this is gonna be too high, and then we need some doors. No. Where's my doors? There. Uh, I'm gonna put those at three and those at two. So we're gonna go like this, so we get like kind of a castle wall deal. I kind of like that. Oh, we made another mistake. See, it's it's when you try not to make any mistakes, that's when it's gonna happen, guys. You're gonna make a load of mistakes. 
Okay, I think we might have enough. I think I'm gonna make it. I don't have to craft anything new, I'm hoping. So I'm gonna go uh, put plant species X in here. Um, you know, for like a defense for the wall. Not that it's really needed, but I think it's really cool that if, if a dino gets close to the wall, it's gonna get shot through the wall. Uh, because what I basically do is I remove one of these walls and I'll put in a plant species X like I did at the gate. And it's just gonna shoot stuff. And it's fun. <laughs> it's fun to watch stuff getting killed. Um, now, I kind of wanna... I want to be able to get in here and actually get on top, so we might do like some ramps up here. So I, I should be able to just close this off here. And yeah, we'll make that a door as well. Okay, so we're going to need ceilings and ramps. Now, I definitely need to make some ramps. Definitely. Because I don't have those. Uh, ceilings I do. Like that, and then we'll go in here. Oh, that, like another tip for you guys if you're doing a building project like I'm doing right now just build a smithy like make a foundation build a smithy and just store all your junk in it because it holds so much stuff and it's really really you know useful to have around uh, let's get that we'll go make some ramps here run there you go uh, I think we're gonna need to I just picked up a lot of stuff for two rounds. I'm teeing. Why isn't it teeing? Oh, there we go. A little bit of server lag. Okay. So we've got these rounds. We've got the ceilings. Good. Oh, by the way, look at that, guys. I, I, it's, it's really hard for me because I, I, I'm used to remembering everything I tell you guys in the recordings I do. And then, you know, remind myself that I shouldn't tell you that again. Uh... But, you know, that recording failed, so I've got Rolo. I got him out of the, the cave. Um, we weren't able to pick him up with the Pteranodon, but we were able to pick him up with the RG. So I did that, and uh, I think we should probably do, like, wait on him or something. I don't know. I really have no idea. So far, I can't put him on Wandering yet, because he, he tends to just wander all the way over there. It happened once, and uh, I don't want to risk that. So let's see. No, no. Oh my god, the lags are real today. Uh, let's go like this. Now I don't want to make mistakes with ceilings because ceilings are the most expensive thing you can think of. Uh, okay, so the wall kind of goes up here, right? Like this little bit. And if we build the ceiling here, it's going to be fine. We're we're going to be able to walk on it. But I do want to snap it. Let's see. I do want to snap it. Oh, why? What the heck? Okay, that was weird. Uh, yeah, I wanted like... No, it's, it went wrong again. Oh, well, it's fine now. See, you get this little hole here, but that's fine. You can just... You can walk on it. It's no, it's no problem. Um, let's see. If we make the staircase, we'll, we'll make it a bit more of a here. And we're gonna have a hole in the wall, right? But that's no problem. Uh, yeah, let's do it like that. We can get up here and we can do stuff like shoot people and uh, be safe. Look at the wall, guys. Just, just have a gander. Oh, man, that's so awesome. It's really, really big. Oh, yeah. I like it when it's perfectly straight. I just love it. My OCD just goes wild for that stuff. <laughs> No, I don't really have OCD, but I kind of do in games, you know. Everything has to be perfect, and this just this looks perfect, guys. Really. So, um, if you've learned something today, um, you know, with the wooden pillars and you know raising this foundation and getting it in exactly the straight line by placing fence foundations, uh, please don't forget to give a thumbs up for the video. I would really appreciate it. It helps. It helps me out a lot, and. Uh, it's fun to know that you guys learned something or, uh, you know, enjoyed the video or something like that. Um, now, we do have a lot of time left, so I might as well go do some plant species X, right? There's no harm to that. Uh, gonna keep the egg. Give that to Betsy. 
And we can take back our bow for defenses. There we go, and we can... Oh, don't drop that. And we'll place this back in here. Now, uh, for the corner part, I do want to tell you about the corner. The corner was a pain in my butt. Look at the corner. It's, it's actually closing. And why did this happen? Like, why is it so weird? Um, basically, the fence foundations, they just went, like, diagonal, right? Uh, I don't think they're still there. Let's have a look. Oh, wow, wow. Okay. Yeah, see, you go around the corner here. Like, you've got the straight line going for yourself, and then you go to go to the corner and that's where it went wrong because I didn't think about that that uh, these fence foundations it's no problem if you have one wall but if you have two walls you're gonna end up with this uh, basically this point is gonna end up close to that one but you want to make your corner um, in how do you say that like uh, you, you want to make your corner on the straight end and not on the hill because this is basically the part where it started climbing, you know, like uh, up the hill, and that's where this went wrong. Because this part just got real steep, and now you've got like this hole here. It's not like anyone could ever get in there, and it's actually closed off pretty well. But, you know, it just doesn't look good. It just doesn't do it, you know? So, uh, I haven't actually figured out how to not have that problem but I'm sure there's 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 a there's a good solution for that. Probably is. Like I, I, I probably didn't think about it. So um plant species decks. I kinda wanna put like I wanna put one uh this these are foundations, right? Yeah. These are double foundations by the way. Like I was toying around with getting the foundations stacked on each other but it doesn't work out. Because this one snapped to that one but then this one didn't snap to that one, so you kind of have like a weird, weird little bit here. Um, I don't think, you know, we could get a plant species in this, but this is one layer and those are two layers because I kind of wanted it on the same height. So I think we're just going to do the two layers. We're going to put one right here, just in front of the corner. Let's see, let's just take it away. We're going to put one right there and we're gonna put one like somewhere over here I think he, he wouldn't be able to shoot I think I should think we should put it right here like that so if we have two plant species here they're operating this bit and they're just gonna shoot everything now oh god yeah that's a problem yeah how are we gonna get back Wow. Now we already have the irrigation system in place, so that's that's a real good thing. And I kind of wanna. Oh, I wanna keep these plant species, by the way, because uh, there's another opening over there. Like, I want to spy less for you, but it's not gonna make anything more clear. Like right there, there's a river, and sometimes, like, not very often, but sometimes something wanders off into this place. Uh, but, you know, most of the things that, that hurt my dinos or want to hurt my dinos come from there. So I'm just going to keep these plant species around uh, just in case something does get in from the other side. Because I'm not going to make a wall all the, way, all the way around. That's just too much materials. Um, so yeah, I'm going to get my uh, crop plots and stuff and I'll be our beast. Hey, and we're back guys. So, um... I took the liberty of placing that guy there. I wanted to make sure it's straight so I had to get up on the wall and stuff like that. It would cost too much time. And it's raining so we have to hurry up. Um, I deleted this, uh, these water tanks here for the other ones because I didn't think it was going to fit. Because if you look at this, this is going to go down like this, yeah? And basically you're going to have the problem that uh, they're going to hit each other. So I'm, I'm kind of thinking that we might actually go down a little bit earlier. But it might... Nah. No, we're not doing that. We're gonna get these guys up. And then we're gonna bring him down. It's gonna be a bit weird, but... Uh, I guess that's just gonna be how it is. Uh, I, want, I just wanna make sure that the wall has his defenses before uh, the other one. Because the wall is more important. It's that easy. Now, of course, this is not gonna be straight. This is gonna be anything but straight, but it's, it's kind of necessary. Because I can replace these foundations, but it's not going to look any good. 
and uh, it's gonna have a roof and everything so you're not really gonna notice it uh, let's see do we want to do this or do we want to go down hold on we can do that we can go vertical I do have a vertical pipe here let's go vertical oh yeah that should do it and then go straight and place the intersection I hope it does snap to it I have no idea let's see oh yeah so we're gonna have one we can have them everywhere what oh there's a pipe in here why is there a pipe in there I don't even okay so this one goes a bit like that and then we should have one right there does that make sense it's it's a real shame you can't really see these things because <laughs> I have no idea where the ends are now. Uh, let's just, you know, while it's raining, we should put at least this guy down, I guess. This guy goes straight, then you get into the intersection, which is right here. Uh, I'm just going to place it here, and I'm going to place one there. I'll look at that, that's perfect. And uh, this is probably going to be for the inside. I'm just going to do it like this, and they should be filling up now. Yeah, they are. Okay, they're filling up. Um, I'm guessing that these guys are feeding him right now. Oh, egg. Uh, not irrigated. Well, it might take a while. And uh, this, this should do it. This should do it. Okay, this is irrigated. We can see that. So we can continue on inside now. Uh, let's see. Oh, we could actually go here. No, I want it in the roof. I want it in the roof. That. Okay, then we want to go right here. Is it placing? Oh, yeah, it is. Just a little bit of lag. We should fall in a hole pretty soon. There we are. Uh, I don't like this. <laughs> that hurts my that hurts my eyes. I don't want to do it like that. Should we go like this? No, that's even worse. Okay, so now I'm just gonna go like this. Let's just do it for now. Kind of didn't think about that. And I want to know where the holes are. Uh, okay, so there's a hole right there. One, two, three, four. Oh, don't want to fall off here. Two, three. This should be the plant species. One more. Okay, and then we could go straight down, I think. Uh, we don't have vertical. Here. Vertical. Get that one there. Let's see where we end up. Uh, uh, that's probably not gonna do it. It's probably not gonna hit the. Uh, wait, it might. It might. They have quite a big range. These plant plant things. Let's see. Let's put it like that. Come on, you just did it. You just you just said yes. Okay, I'm fine. No, please. Yes? Okay. Great. Now if we put a tap on that, it should work. Uh, it's close enough, I think. Not irrigated. Irrigated. Great. Done. Never touch it again. Uh, I think I brought three each. Yeah. Three each. That, sh that should do it for now. Wow, it's already empty? <laughs> it ran for two seconds and it's empty. Are you kidding me right now? Uh, did I put the seeds in? No. Yes, yes I did. Seedling, okay. Now for the next one that's over there. So we have to go one, one, two, three, four, five, six, six more. And uh, that's, that should do it. Now, I don't know why these things just drained in a second. Like, it rained for quite a bit. After I placed them, that is. Uh, let's see, we have to go, oh wait, 
I might I might just go irrigate that stuff, you know, like I might just get a thing going from the <clears throat> What is it from the from the swamp? Because I don't like waiting around for rain. Let's get this stuff. Get back up there. Mer, 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 mer. And it should be here, right? Oh no, it's wow, it's even up the ramp. That's gonna be great because this thing's gonna disappear inside of the ramp. And I like that. I like it. Come on. There we go. So this should do it. Yeah, we might we might just place a place a oh, what's happening here? We might just place one of those inclined things. Ugh, get up here. Let's see. Oh, we, we're right there. So, do we have incline? Yes, we do. That should... Oh, that's perfect, guys. Uh, first, we should do this one. Because it might say it's red. Because that tap is right there, you know. Why is it... Every time I pick one up, it's like... It, I'm green. And then, when I want to place it, it goes red. That's not fair. Come on. Work with me, stupid, stupid crop species, plop thing. I hate you. It was green, so I know it's not interfering with the, uh, with the other thing, right? <sighs> and we're back. I got it. <laughs> there we go. Okay, so this is perfect, actually. This is the best watering you can get. We can get these guys in there, and. Um, they should start growing and next episode you, we should be able to see some progress on that um, now I know there's a hole in the wall and probably someday I'll, I'll find a fix for that I'll, I'll think about it and if I do I'm certainly gonna show you guys but for now these things are gonna grow and they're gonna shoot everything that comes near like that scorpion right there that scorpion's just being an ass so uh, it would shoot them and uh, it's perfect because nothing's gonna harass my wall and um, for now, I want to thank you guys for watching, and I hope you enjoyed the episode. Uh, once again, if you learned anything or if you enjoyed the episode, please don't forget to hit that like button for me. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Well, let me do the wave. See you later. Bye.